I get totally nostalgic this time of year, thinking back to when I was a boy and we would decorate our tree by stringing up cranberries and popcorn and- Microjig, maker of the gripper. Work safer, work smarter. This week's episode is also sponsored by Casper. This week on Woodworking for Mere Mortals, I've got this cool gift box with a sliding dovetail lid that you can customize to fit whatever you like inside. In my case, it holds an extra fancy pair of Korean style chopsticks and chopsticks rest. Some kids want video games for Christmas. My son wanted a pair of high-end specialty chopsticks. I'm gonna start by cutting this board down to oversized pieces. This is the third week in a row I've used this sled for cutting thin slices, but it works really well. All right, with that all sanded on the inside, I can glue the bottom in place. I've installed a dovetail bit into my router and I've raised it up just the thickness of the lid. The dovetail angles out this way and this way. I need to do it on this side. So I've left the template on here so I can see how far I need to go. Here you can see how that dovetail angles out this way. Now I can move the fence over and just plow out that middle part. Using that same router bit, I can cut this lid down to size a little bit at a time until I get a good fit in this slot. Right now, it's kind of a tight fit, but rather than make another cut on the router, I'll just sand it down a little bit. Here's where you can customize the inside to fit whatever you're gonna put in the box, say a necklace or earrings. I think for jewelry, it would look nice to line the inside with velvet. I cut out these little pieces to size it to my chopsticks and holder. Make sure this still fits. Yep. I'll finish these with spray lacquer. Sleep in heavenly peace. How jumps good old Santa Claus. Do you hear what I hear? Yeah, I saw mommy kissing Santa Claus. I brought some corn for popping. Here comes Santa Claus. He sees you when you're sleeping. Ooh, ten lords a leaping. Pum, rumpa, pum, pum. Yeah, I'll be home for Christmas. If only in my dreams. Won't you guide my sleigh tonight? And don't forget, Casper mattresses combine just the right amount of memory foam and latex foam for just the right amount of squish and sink and bounce back. It's an obsessively engineered mattress at a shockingly fair price, and it's made right here in America. Try one out for 100 days with free delivery. And for even more holiday cheer, I want you to take $50 off any mattress purchase by going to casper.com slash woodworking and entering the promo code woodworking at checkout. It's perfect if you have no crib for a bed. I think this gift box turned out really nice. The lid slides on easily and kind of just stays in place with a friction fit. If the lid is sticky or feels too tight, try sanding a little bit inside of the dovetail or adding some paste wax. If the lid feels too loose, you can add one of these little rare earth magnets in one corner. Hope you enjoyed the sliding dovetail gift box. They're pretty easy to make and they really are a special way of 
giving somebody a gift. It's fun to customize it to fit whatever you want to put in it. If you're looking for more ideas for gift projects for the holidays, check out this playlist. Lots of ideas and inspiration. Plenty of easy projects you can make that aren't going to cost you a lot of money. I want to thank all of you for watching Woodworking for Mere Mortals throughout 2015 and all of my projects. This is the last project video of the year. Next week I'll have a last minute gift buying guide for woodworkers and then I'll return in January with regular project videos. Thanks again everybody and happy holidays. Well, and the video games.